Hello, I'm Daniel, and welcome to the Moon Project. We here at the Moon Project are continuing in our series of videos with respect to information, education, inspiration, guidance, advice, and I want to talk a little bit about um, sometimes when the Creator sends uh, hardships and uh, punishment our way, he often does it mida keneged mida, measure for measure. What goes around comes around. In other words, the punishment will often match or reflect what you've done wrong. Uh, it says in the book of Psalms 121.5, um, that God, the Lord, um, is your shadow. So the Baal Shem Tov explains, well, this means that how you do things, God follows. Your actions are reflected um, by God. Um, if you do something wrong, God will repay in that line. And uh, either this world, in this world, or in the world to come. Uh, in the Talmud, in Masech um, Brachos 5a, our sages say an interesting thing. He says, let a person examine his um, sufferings, and then he will have insight into what he's done wrong, either character deficiencies, if he's, you know, acting in an improper way, and if he doesn't find anything objectionable, attribute it to a lack of Torah study. And uh, Harav uh, Chaim Volozhner says what I would say. What is Hazal? What, is, what are our sages talking about? If he finds nothing objectionable, let him attribute it to a lack of Torah study. Isn't Bittel Torah, isn't the neglect of Torah study in and of itself something objectionable? Isn't it worth, you know, punishment? What the Rav Chaim Volozhner means, I think, is that if you cannot directly attribute it to anything specific, the lack of Torah study affects all mitzvahs. It affects your whole life. If you don't study properly, you can't um, pray properly. You can't perform commandments, mitzvahs, properly. You can't uh, lead a good and holy and, uh, and, uh, uh, and righteous life. It comes from the learning. A lack of Torah study affects your entire life, your entire outlook. Um, so sometimes when you have general Torahs, general, you know, uh, bad things happening in your life, and you view it, and you view it as like, you know, why me? Why, you know, why me? What did I do? Why, why, God's mad at me. Look at yourself. See if the punishment fits the offense. And if not, maybe it's a general punishment because what you're doing is of a general nature, lack of Torah study. Um, you'll, you're free to do what you want. Believe me, no one's forcing you, but decisions have consequences, either in this world or in the world to come. We're going to be doing more videos along these lines. Please come back. Please watch. Please learn. And until next time, on behalf of the Immuno Project, I'm Daniel, and thank you too much.